Greetings my loves, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Join me in this video as I walk you through my signature brows. This video is well detailed. Please stay tuned, like, comment, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you. The first thing I do, I use my brow tamer from TM Essentials to lay the brows down. Then I will use my setting powder to make sure there is no oil on the brows before I start drawing. So after putting the setting powder, I will dust it off. When drawing, I use a dark brown to line, then fill in with a light brown. So basically what I'm doing right now, I'm just trying to line the brows following her natural brows. When doing brows, please take your time, but do not sleep on the brows because there is no time. Time waits for nobody. So just do it gentle, follow the natural brows, do not overline. Just follow what the client or the model already have. This video is well detailed and self-explanatory. So in case you are confused in any form, please do not hesitate to leave your question in the comments section. Please make sure your pencil is well sharpened. Right now, I'm filling it in with a light brown. So what I'm doing is that I'm following her natural hairline stroke and I'm only filling where there is no hair. Because if you feel where there is hair, the, the brows will look too, too thick and you won't like the end result. And when you are filling your brows, do it light handed. Do not apply pressure so it will still look natural. Thank you. After filling in, I use mascara wand. That's pull it to brush it up. My camera woman did not capture that. So after brushing it up, I will go in with my concealer. So I'm using Zikio concealer. I'm using the lighter. I will use the lighter shade at her brow bone. Then at the tip of the brows, I will use a darker shade. Then in front of the brows, beginning of the brows, I'll also use a darker shade. Reason because I don't want harsh line. I want everything to blend into her skin. I don't want it to see beginning, the end. Then from the top of the brows, I use her foundation shade. to blend you will be needing or you need to use a fluffy brush to blend very well you can also use a what they call a beauty blender small one to blend then why why working on the brows do not pack concealer because when you do that when your client or your model is on the sun the concealer will start melting and you won't like the end result adding a darker concealer shade to blend the is it the tail of yeah the tail of the brows yeah when i was doing voiceover last night rain started i have to stop this morning again i'm doing my voiceover and it's raining like i'm prepping her skin for her under eyes for eyeshadow so that to catch the fallout here I'm using a powder to set the concealer, very very important, please set your concealer after working. This is the end of this tutorial, please like if you enjoyed the video, comment, share and subscribe to my channel, thank you.